Good morning guys. So it is currently Saturday morning about uh, 8 o'clock and um, today I want to do something I've never done before. I've had this idea of something that I want to build for quite a while and that is a, a color palette inspiration site. Uh, I want it to be curated, um, super clean, super nice, uh, just a place for people to go to find inspiration of uh, color palettes to use. So I had this crazy goal to build and launch that within 24 hours. And uh, I'm gonna bring you guys along for that ride. Uh, but first, I need caffeine. So the reason I'm challenging myself to do this is because uh, I see so many people, myself included, we have an idea, we talk about them, but we don't actually do the work to make them happen. So today is all about execution. I'm going to do, um, just build a MVP of my idea. It doesn't have to be perfect, doesn't have to have a crazy amount of features. The goal today is simply to uh, design it, code it, and get it up. Obviously I don't want it to be shitty, uh, so there's a balance there that I'll have to strike, but I'm not going to let my uh, perfectionism stop me from launching this. Hey, can I please get two grande flat whites with uh, vanilla and coconut milk? Anything else? Nope, that should do it. So quick update, um, I've gone ahead and I've created a logo. So it's based upon the uh, Little Faces characters I designed back in uh, at the end of my daily design series, uh, the laughing emoji. So it's based on uh, this guy right here, the uh, laughter crying LOL emoji. So um, I'm going to use him mostly for this logo, but I've decided to uh, do it like this so it has the, uh, the color palette in the, in the logo itself. All right, so it's about 9.30 now. Um, I've done a bit of planning and wireframing. Uh, one thing I have yet to decide is what I will end up building this with. So on one hand, I could use Rails. On the other, I could use WordPress. Uh, overall, it's gonna be a pretty simple site. I just need the CRUD actions, the ability to uh, create, read, update, and destroy um, color palette. I also want uh, users to be able to vote or heart on a color palette, and then finally filter between popular and uh, recent uh, color palette. In the end, what I use doesn't really matter. Um, the goal is to build something. It's not about what I use to build it. So there's a ton of things I could do with this site. Like I could add users. I could let users like uh, create profiles with their favorite color palettes. Um, but I don't want to do any of that right now. Uh, today is just about getting an MVP, so the minimum product out and launched. So why I'm deciding between uh, Rails and WordPress, I'm going to uh, jump into Photoshop and start working on the design. So it's now about uh, six o'clock almost. Um, I spent a few hours getting some lunch with my wife, but I wasted several hours trying to uh, figure out if I should use WordPress or Rails. Uh, in retrospect, I should have had that uh, thought out well in advance, but you live and learn. So for this uh, site, I've decided to use Rails to build it. And that's because uh, thinking about it, uh, future-proofing it, I feel like where I could take it eventually, not not right now, but eventually, uh, if I want to build it up into something bigger, um, Rails would be a lot easier to do that with than WordPress. All right, so like I said, it's about 6 p.m. here. I did get a bit of front end work done. Uh, there's still a bit more to do, uh, but the bulk of the work will be the Rails stuff. I'm hoping about two, three more hours uh, worth of work I can have something to show, at least locally, and then uh, probably a bit more time uh, to get it up on Heroku and live. But in order to make that happen, I need to jump back on the computer and start coding. Let's do this. So 
So it's about uh, 9.30 right now. I've uh, been at this for about 13 hours so far. Well, minus the uh, few hours I took for uh, lunch with my wife. But so far I've gotten uh, the front end pretty much done. Uh, the rail stuff almost done. Uh, there's still a lot to be done. I still need to um, make it responsive. I need to uh, test everything and make sure it's all good. Um, I'm not exactly positive if the voting system is working correctly yet, so I'll need to uh, test that a bit before I uh, push it live. But I am making progress. I'm thinking I may be able to finish it before midnight. At the very least, I'll finish it before 8 a.m. tomorrow, which will make it under 24 hours, which is the goal. So what I got so far, I got the layout all coded. I set it up to where it will scale indefinitely as large as the uh, a viewport is, but when you get down here, it obviously doesn't look great and it breaks, so I'll need to fix that. But it's uh, almost there. One last thing I need to do is when you hover over these, I want to have a tooltip pop out with the, uh, the hex code. All right, so the final update. I am excited to say that I am finally uh, finished, at least with the MVP. Um, it took quite a bit longer than I expected. It is currently, um, 3.15 a.m. So I have been at it for uh, I think roughly 20 hours, somewhere around there. Um, but I made it, I got it done within the uh, 24 hour window. So I'm excited about that. Uh, one of the reasons it ended up taking so long is because I kept going down rabbit holes and trying various things that ended up not working and um, uh, I ended up wasting a bunch of time. So future note, if I ever do this again, I just need to uh, plan better and think through everything I'm going to do uh, beforehand before I jump into actually building it. So I'm really excited to uh, show you what I've done. Check it out. All right. So check it out. LOLcolors.com. Uh, we got all the color palettes. Well, I've got about 30 of them in here so far, uh, but we can vote on them. If you hover over them, uh, the, uh, Hex code will uh, show up, which is pretty awesome. Uh, you can uh, vote on them, sort between the popular ones. It scales down and it's all responsive too. So I am pretty excited about it. All right guys, go check it out, lolcolors.com. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Um, there's probably gonna be bugs, so if you notice anything, just uh, let me know and I'll I'll uh, do my best to fix those. So before I go to bed, I want to challenge you. Uh, just as I did with this project, I was uh, putting it off for a while. Um, that was the reason I set a 24-hour uh, deadline and just made it happen. So I want to challenge you, what is that one project, that one thing that you've been putting off for too long? I want you to set a deadline and do the work to make it happen. So let me know what that project is um, and your timeline and plan of attack in the comments below. I really want to hear what you guys are working on and I'm excited to see uh, what you guys can do. All right guys, I'm exhausted. I will catch you guys later this week. See ya.